Good evening, new tonight. A major shakeup on Capitol Hill. Senator Mitch McConnell announcing today he will step down as Republican leader in the Senate. Our Mackenzie Laporte spoke to our local leaders over in D.C. to get their reactions on this decision. Mackenzie. That's right, Don and Stacey. Now, our local leaders shared with us what a complete surprise Senator McConnell's decision was for many on Capitol Hill. And with McConnell stepping down, what's next for the future of Congress? Well, we spoke to our congressional leaders right here in the Midwest to gather possible next steps. After decades of leadership, Republican leader Senator Mitch McConnell stepping down. With a standing ovation on Capitol Hill, congressional leaders showed mixed reactions when asked about Wednesday's decision. Mitch McConnell and I have served together in the Senate during my entire career, and I've worked with him many times uh, on an informal and formal basis. I feel like he's a friend. While reflecting on the past, Illinois Senator Dick Durbin continued to share that the news was something he could see coming. He did. Uh, I, I just suspected it and he he mentioned he's gone through some health issues, some challenges, and I'm sure that had a lot to do with it. And while Senator Durbin suspected the decision, Iowa Senator Chuck Grassley was surprised to hear the news. It's a complete surprise, I'm sure, to all 48 other Republican senators. I never heard anything about it. I never suspicioned it. Senator Grassley added that not everyone from the Republican Party favored McConnell. There's been some difference within the Republican caucus uh, uh, favoring him. But, uh, you know, we have 49 Republican senators. We all don't think alike. Over in Missouri, Senator Josh Hawley at odds with McConnell, sharing that he is the reason that the Radiation Exposure Compensation Act is set to expire for many Missourians and others across the country. And I'm glad he is for reasons like this. It's time that this stops. These backroom deals, this prioritizing of defense contractors over Americans, of corporations over regular people who are out there working for a living, it has to stop. Holly took to X after the news broke, stating, quote, I called the McConnell to step down over a year ago. This is good news, but why wait so long? We need leadership now. At the end of the day, Senator McConnell isn't going anywhere anytime soon. Now, he may be stepping down as the Republican leader, but he still plans to serve in the Senate. Working for you, I'm Mackenzie Laporte. Thanks, Mackenzie. Now, McConnell plans to serve out his term, which ends in 2027. Thanks for watching. Stick around by subscribing today and don't miss a single video.